as a second part of this session we will learn how to work with get file content using path action now if you observe get file content will get the content by using file whereas get file content using path action will use the path to retrieve or to read the data from the particular file let me drag and drop this action onto the workspace the main purpose of get file content using path action is to get the content or to retrieve the content of a particular file using file path if you see the parameters i am having file path this is the file path of the particular file which you want to retrieve the content now in our case i am going to use pid document i am going to select the folder that is from the root subfolder power automate desktop and inside that i am having pid document so now here we are going to providing as path over here right and then the output will be stored in the get file content by path response this variable content the value of the particular file that is in binary format let's click on save i am going to use this convert data to file action to convert a binary data to file format let me move this action after get file content using path and then in the convert binary data to file i'm going to give the input variables such as get file content by path response there if you see the binary data i'm going to give it as get file content by path response and then the file path i'm going to give it as output 2.docx that is the file path where we are going to write the data which has been converted binary data to file format and then the third parameter if files already exist then we are going to write it else we are going to do nothing so as of now i have selected if file already exist and then i am going to click on save now i am going to disable this action that is get file content now if you observe in our output folder we don't have output 2.docx once we will run this desktop flow we will get it output 2.docx all right let's run the flow to see the output flow execution started now it is trying to convert the binary data to file if you see over here we got the output 2.docx now the flow has executed successfully now let me open the output 2.docx there if you observe my output file that is output 2.docx i am having some content now if you observe as an output i got the flow variables let's double click on that there you can see the variable value is get file content by path response which is in binary format now if you see the property what is the property get file content by path response which is in binary format and you can see the byte 15478 is the size of the particular file all right let me click on close this binary data is converting into file by using convert binary data to file which we have stored in the output that is the output 2.docx all right i hope you understand how to work with get file content using path action